My name is Jacoby Chalk and I am a minister of the gospel. I've been preaching since I was about uh, 11 years old. Uh, I got licensed probably about a year ago and I'm also the minister of music at my church. I say I realized I was called to minister probably about uh, six years ago. Um, but the call has always been evident in my life. Uh, I remember as a young kid coming home from uh, church service and reenacting what happened at service. <laughs> so I say the call has always been there. Some of my accomplishments is I had the opportunity to speak at the state convocation. I've had the opportunity to uh, say the prayer at the national convocation. I've also had the opportunity to be uh, on Evangelist Joyce Rogers Youth Advisory Council and of course uh, one of my accomplishments is receiving my minister's license. I represent the Church of God in Christ which is a Pentecostal church. Um, to me religion is the belief that there is a system of works in which I must perform in order to earn my way into heaven. And, it's the thought that I can do this and I can do that and I can't do this and I can't do that. While a relationship is merely based on your love for Christ and as your love for Christ begins to mature and develop, then there are automatically some things you're just not going to do and there's some things that you are going to do. That's all God wants from us. He just wants us to love Him. His greatest commandment was to love him. His greatest commandment was not to do this or do that or don't do this or don't do that. His greatest commandment, he said, Thou shalt love the Lord with all thy heart, all thy soul, and with all thy mind. A misconception that the world has about Christianity is that we're all judgmental and hypocritical people. And I believe that they have that misconception because uh, we have portrayed that. But uh, even as I stated earlier, there are some of us who are uh, real Christians who have a real relationship with Christ. And then there's the other, you know, bad seeds who don't really portray Christianity. And I see that in society today, it seems that we have forgotten God. It seems that we have idolized other things and we've left God. We forgot that God said, I am God and there is no other gods before me. Um, some challenges I've encountered as being a minister is actually having to live out this life in my young years because I made this decision when I was in middle school and I'm now in high school and I have to say that's a great challenge trying to live the right life in such a environment where it is the norm to behave a certain way and uh, it's a challenge sometimes to go against the grain. It's a shame how as young people, not only young people, how we betray God for just a few moments of fun, or just a few moments of what we see as pleasurable. One thing I want to point out is where you always notice that in the Bible, it seems that God is trying to draw people when they're in their youth. Uh, one reason is it is usually when we are young that are most full that we are most full of energy and physically yeah. strong yeah. and healthy enough to most enjoy God. Yeah. So he wants us when we're strong. Uh, one of my best experiences uh, as a minister, I have to say, was when I had the opportunity to speak at the state convocation. Uh, it was then that my preaching really took off. That was the um, time that really just set it off and then I started getting calls and people wanted me to come and run revivals and preach here and preach there so I think that is one of my uh, best experiences. One of my worst experiences I say uh, is my first time preaching because uh, I still remember that day uh, I had no idea what I was doing. I was just standing up at the podium and uh, I remember finishing and uh, not knowing how to end, so I looked to the side where my granny was sitting now, and I look over there and I whisper to her, I'm done. <laughs> and uh, so it was kind of embarrassing, and I have to say that's my worst experience. My ultimate goal is to uh, win as many souls as I can, you know. I may not win them all, but uh, while I'm here, my goal is to win as much as I can.